اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم فائن تذہبون ان ہوا اللہ ذکر للعالمین لمن شاء منکم ان یستقیم وما تشاؤن اللہ ان یشاء اللہ رب العالمین صدق اللہ علی العظیم Dear students, second year class, lecture number two, tissue culture, transgenic living things and importance of the biotechnology I will discuss. And I will start from the same topic which I finished in the last lecture about the electrophoresis technique that was used to make the distinction between different DNA. So if you have three DNA and three DNA, are, you can make a distinction between them because each DNA has different palindromic sequences or RFLP sites. This is the natural gift to the DNA. Otherwise, sequence of nucleotide we can't calculate very easily. That is quite laborious work. So this is a shortcut to identify different DNA because you will use three different uh, uh, you will use uh, the different RFLP sites. For example, this DNA has different RL, RFLP sites. This DNA has the different RFLP sites. And the molecular scissor quality is that it will cut the DNA only at these sites which I am mentioning because they consist of specific palindromic sequences. As a result, what will happen? The three each three DNA after the action of molecular scissor, their their parts will be very different size with a different size look at the different size are achieved of three different persons and when you will follow them in this electrophoresis machine having a nitrocellulose membrane with agarose gel to reduce the friction because the DNA will move from negative potential to positive potential due to phosphate negative charge when they will flow according to density gradient they will be separated from each other some will flow more some will flow less because some are heavier length some are lighter length some are medium length so all lengths of DNA are different and these three individual lengths are also different friend you will see them if you want to check their some sequence not all sequence of nucleotide some sequence of nucleotide you can check by adding probe by adding probe so i can tell you how you can check by probe it's very easy you use a uh, you use just color any color uh, probe for example this is a guanine you are adding from outside so if the cytosine present here the guanine will combine with the cytosine because guanine is the probe and that is radio Radioactive will show radioactive rays and in the electrophoresis machine you is will instantly know that which is your nucleotide which is your radioactive nucleotide in the probe has been combined so then you can identify <clears throat> that the genuine nucleotide in the DNA is the cytosine because this is very simple you just play a game because uh, you have a cytosine in the electrophoresis technique uh, you got a DNA DNA length in which cytosine and guanine are there so when you will enter adenine thymine guanine cytosine four radioactive rays four probe because each probe consists of one nucleotide so adenine will combine here so it means uh, adenine will combine will not combine so there is no thymine guanine you will add the guanine will combine here here will be the rays will come out you under, uh, you will understand this is cytosine when cytosine probe you will use here so this will glow because reason cytosine combine with the guanine so probe will be used to identify the sequence of nucleotide but you can't calculate the all dna this is just this this is just a force and science just like aeroplane is crash crashed and you just wanted to know that how the uh, you just wanted to know how the DNA, uh, how the DNA uh, is different in one in a person and another person's. I will tell you, for example, if you want to calculate uh, the DNA sequence of three uh, persons, a father and child. This is a father and child dispute, I will tell you. Look here, father and child dispute is more common in hospitals. Aeroplanes are crashed, dead bodies are unable to identify. I will show this is the uh, father and child dispute. How you will identify the father and child dispute in this case? 
there is the child this is the child this is the father number one this is the father number two you can identify father number two is german father you can see the lines the size of the dna fragments which are achieved by the uh, molecular scissor having rest different restriction sites and they are flowing them into nitrocellulose membrane of electrophoresis machine on agarose gel in electric potential their final setting was this one and father one their final setting was this one father uh, father one final this final setting was this one but in this figure you can see that father two is more closer if you will check it i make it clear look at this child look closer to father two this child closer to father two this child closer to father two similarly it is closer to father two similarly it is closer to father two so father two is more closer to the child so when father two is more closer to the child now i can assess that father two is the father of the child this is the force and size by this way you can calculate uh, you can identify the dead bodies as happened in karachi aeroplane crash now i will tell you the sequence of nucleotide is very difficult phenomena it's not easier phenomena i want your attention look here i make a three nucleotide dna i want to identify their sequence adenine thymine guanine i will cut the dna i will cut the dna not by molecular scissor i will cut synthetically synthetically after each nucleotide after each nucleotide this is very important students i want your attention otherwise this is total conceptual base this is not a memorization this anybody can understand because it is a quite complex when you will uh, uh, memorize it is very easy when you will understand the phenomena that if you will cut the after a this a adenine will become this is adenine when you will cut after thymine it become the at at so this is the second when you will cut after g it will become this length you clear it mean when adenine is there this length will come when thymine you will cut this length will come thus i will draw figure once again and i will tell you you can see this one okay when i will cut after a this length will come when i, I will cut after t this length will come because a t both are available understand when i will cut after g this long i long length i can make yes a t g you clear now you will be thinking sir you have one dna sequence so how you have one dna so how you can make you will cut after a t c will be left no that is the use of pcr machine in the last lecture listen my last lecture i need multiple copies of the dna for sequencing of nucleotide like the coronavirus testing if i want to check the sequence of three nucleotide i want three copies if i want to know the millions nucleotides copy i want millions copy so i want three dna in this case in one dna the three similar copies of dna simi three similar copies of this one so i will cut in one dna i will cut after a i will get this one in second dna i will cut after t i will get a t in third one i will get after g i will get this one so what will happen what will happen these three different dna these three different dna i will use in testing the i will use by synthetic nucleotide synthetic nucleotide so i will make these three parts one part second part third part so three different dna i got one consist of one nucleotide other other uh, other one finishing at a other finishing at t the third finishing at c for example for example i just want to know the sequence of nucleotide so okay. what will happen a second finishing acha okay now i will use the synthetic nucleotide now i will use the synthetic what is the synthetic nucleotide dda dideoxyadenine dideoxythymine they that nucleotide is synthetic that is closer to the natural nucleotide but it will not continue replication it mean that i will i will got a test tube in which this nucleotide i will enter and i will enter the genuine nucleotides as well genuine four nucleotides as well and the artificial nucleotide as well dda as well so what will happen that when the dda will combine dda will combine in the replication the replication will not continue and the size of the dna will remain this one and it will finish similarly when i will uh, in the case of this one 
in the case of t for example this is a length it is a t it is a a it is a c when i will enter this dna into the into the test tube when i will enter this dna into the test tube and what will happen what will happen when i will enter this uh, dna into the test tube with a genuine nucleotide and with a synthetic nucleotide synthetic nucleotide mean dda ddc so d d, d, d adenine will combine with the thymine with the natural okay cytosine will combine with the natural okay guanine but thymine when it will combine with the dda artificial so this replication will stop this replication will stop now that is the very significant phenomena which i just wanted to tell you that uh, when these three uh, three lengths will come three lengths will come three lengths uh, one is this one one is this one one is this one okay one is finishing at a for suppose one is finishing at t and one is finishing at c so when i will use in the electrophoresis technique they will be separated from each other like this one like this one they will be separated from each other so if the now i will tell you that how this sequence we calculated now this is the strand okay this is the guanine first was the guanine so guanine was when i cut from here this length was very small it moved very closer to the negative ch positive charge and it is just came first of all in the sequence and that was basically guanine because guanine was length was small second was the adenine and when the adenine look here second was the adenine so this was the strand having guanine and adenine because you need multiple copies of the dna when you use g and a both the g and a both when you will use the g a was little heavier little heavier than the g because it has more density it has more weight uh, density so it will move after the g so after the g it will be a and you can see it is after the g i will finish uh, here lines that you can see that it is after the g after the g after the ga because a is heavier than g because it consists of two nucleotides understand because i got first line first line was g clear first line was g with one nucleotide second when i cut the dna at two nucleotide stage g a so g a was the last so it was little heavier one this one so after g a come when g a c will come g a c third one it consists of three nucleotide g a c it was quite heavier than the g a so it came after a I will finish the lines see after a where is the situation after a where is the situation after a just hold on I am going why it is not moving just yes it will move now after a you can see now after a the C come C because this was heavier so it was not moving much it was lighter after this was lighter after this was lighter it was having one nucleotide only it was having two nucleotide it was three why they achieved due to d d adenine d d guanine d d thymus thymine d d cytosine reason because those were unable to continue their application because those were synthetic so lecture number two will continue with the part two session you will see definitely see the part two session thank you very much second year